to life is very difficult there. They have to collect the food and prepare the food by their own. There is no gas, no money to, no salary, no money to buy the gas. So they have also to bring water from far away. So it's like everything is stopped. I cannot do research. I mean, it's, it's, it's very difficult situation. Also for almost 10 months, we are not getting any salary. Some academic people, they don't have even money for transportation. How I go to the, the lab, how I come back? There is no, I mean, I mean, petrol from my car. I was like uh, working very hard on the internet, how to find another place. I tried so many, I mean, places. I tried like in, in I mean, in some area, in Arabic country, and I tried in many places until I get the contact from to us, which I really thankful for them. I think this is the impact for the, uh, the, the 2016 award, the Safir Award. I hope that I am going to get the visa and go to Germany with my husband and do the research. My fellowship to Germany, two years. If the situation in Yemen is stable after two years, of course, I'd like to go back between my, fa and my family and my student and my life there. But if the things is it's getting worse, and I hope not, I think I'll find another place. Because I really like to, 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 to represent Yemen. If I stay in Yemen, I cannot do anything.